Yes! I found this at a store for $24.99, 25 bucks. It's a miniature claw machine, and you can fill it up with candy, kind of like you see at a lot of arcades and everything else. We are going to unbox this and see if it is actually trash or something genuinely awesome and cool. Now, it is an absolute dream to own an arcade, at least for me. Now, when you go and buy one of these things, the big question you're gonna ask yourself is, do you plug it in or do you use batteries? It takes batteries, you're gonna need D batteries, three of them to be exact. The second question you're gonna ask yourself is, does this come with some starter candy? And the answer is no. So you're gonna have to go out and buy something that will be like small enough but still cool enough to have the claw grab. So what I wound up doing, I went to Dollar General, I bought a few things. This is uh, Reese's Miniature Cups with Reese's Puffs inside. Almond Joy Miniatures, Caramel Creams, one of my favorites right there. And I also went to uh, Target and I bought some of these little erasers that look like hot dogs and burgers and sandwiches. The claw, that's what they call this thing, the claw. And on the front here it says, it's so much fun, once you start, you just can't stop. Fill with any prize, candy, gum, or toys. The hot new electronic arcade game for the home. It has fun action music, just like the arcade, and it's as seen on TV. I never saw the commercial for these, but apparently it was. Now this thing has a little coin slot with uh, tokens you could put into it, and the tokens are included, so there's at least that. And there are three different joysticks, one to move up and down, one left and right, and one to drop the claw up and down. So that'll be fun to try. On the side here it says, test your skills with the claw. Set your sights on a prize and move the controls up, down, left, and right to grab it and drop it down. The shoot before the music stops. Let's get in and unbox this thing. All right, very top here, we have all the battery installation instructions here. That's, that's a fairly decent size, actually. I was thinking it was going to be a little smaller. I mean, just for comparison, there's a bottle of Crystal Pepsi next to it. Yeah, pretty decent size, actually. Okay, so in the top here, it has open and remove tie around crane prior to use. Let's open this up. Okay. Do I take the bag off this way? Come here. <sighs> Stupid bag, come on. <sighs> come on, get down. Can I get this? Oh yeah. Ah, oh, yeah, success. Okay, so first we gotta place three D batteries in the battery compartment. <laughs> I could have easily cut it right there. Oh well, be a man. Okay, so we got the batteries in. Now it's time to place prizes or candy in the compartment on the top of the claw. Okay, so now it's time. Let's put an Almond Joy in there. A Reese's, another Reese's, another Reese's. 
another Almond Joy. Put some caramel creams in there. What do you say, about five? Yeah, let's do five. I'll put the rest of the Reese's in here because they are quite colorful. It'll look nice inside the machine. Let's say we put a hot dogger in there. Whoop. Sleeve of fries. A raspberry chocolate raspberry cake. Put that in there. Of course, we've got to have a burger. A burger. Let's do a strawberry cheesecake as well. Throw that in there. A uh, sandwich. And a bunch of different ice creams here. All right, that's enough. Let's close this up. Throw everything else onto the floor. Now I'm wondering where are the tokens apparently? Are they, I guess they're here. Let's see, ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They're different sizes and different amounts. All right, so we will turn that on. And here is, uh, let's shake all the prizes around there a little bit. We'll start with the 50 cent. Oh. Oh, I didn't lose anything that way. Okay guys, so the rules are with this thing, you get unlimited tries within the given time amount where the music plays. But once the music ends, you lose your turn. You gotta put in another token. So let's see if we could try to get one of these things out of here. A Reese's, I'm gonna try to get a toy, an actual toy, one of these erasers. Ah. Let's get this strawberry shortcake right here. I think I got a chance. Oh, so close. Nothing. Ah. Yes! Yes! Ah! <laughs> I got myself an almond joy, guys. Woo! Winner, winner! <laughs> now it's your turn. I'll get you started here. This is forward and back. This way. Left, or right, and left and you push it down here to drop the crane. And you can stop halfway through if you want. You want the Reese's? All right, let's try that. Ah, oh, nothing. Let's move over here. Let's try to get this Reese's. Oh, oh so close. Let's get this ice cream. So close. Yeah. All right. There we go. Here, so what I think works best is if you have less candy in here, the better. So let's try this. We're gonna get that caramel cream in the back. Okay. This is for Joe. Oh, for Joe. This is for you, buddy. Ah, uh -huh, yeah. There we go. Joe, this is all for you, man. Enjoy. 
So close. Oh. Luckily, we have the infinite money cheat. Now we're going to get it. Yeah. Oh. Yes. Yes. Yes, baby. Now we just got to... Is it going to make... All right. We got to get it past this threshold. Come on. Come on. Ah. Get it down. There we go. Ah, yeah. Perfection. Oh, we got it. It's right there. It is right there. Let's see if we could. All right, be gentle. <gasps> oh! All right. This is for Maximus. Come on, don't fail me now. Here we go. Bang! There you go, Brandon. So right down here is a laser that triggers when something gets in front of it and will let you know you're a winner. Like, see right there. That's pretty high tech for something that's only 25 bucks, but pretty cool. So now that I have seen everything that the claw has to offer, what do I have to say about it? Well, <laughs> I honestly will say that this is probably the best $25 that I have ever spent in my entire life. Now, there are some drawbacks. You got to go out and buy more D batteries if you want this thing to work. Uh, you can't plug it in. That's the one downfall I do see about this. And when it comes to loading this stuff with prizes, don't go too big. And I will definitely say Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, the minis, are definitely not worth it. Um, just because it, the claw is, it's very hard to grab those. Even though I managed to grab one of them, it, it was very, very hard compared to the caramel creams in here which are a lot easier to grab or the almond joys uh almond joys are still kind of hard but like any of these little snack size candy bars or even the bite size uh candies uh work very well and like i uh showed you with the little toy erasers or the sh strawberry shortcakes or whatever those are a little too heavy for this claw to manage so i, I would probably skip that I've heard some people, they talk about crumpling up $1 bills and throwing them in there. That's a good prize. Um, so stuff like that. And don't load it up too much. This claw machine is just like the ones at the arcade where, yeah, the, you're going to have to go through a lot of tries to finally get a prize. But even with those minor drawbacks with the batteries and, you know, you, you can't load this thing up too much. I am thoroughly impressed with this machine. From how the controls worked, the joysticks here, everything ran smoothly, there were no problems, nothing sticking or anything. The music is kind of annoying, don't get me wrong, but it's kind of there as a necessary evil almost. Kind of like to, to gamify it enough to let you know you are on a time limit, so once that music starts kicking in really fast, 
you know you're at the end, you better get yourself something. And I mean, for parents out there, you could take away these tokens and use this as almost like a piggy bank because how this thing gets triggered is there's a little thing right there. You just push to the side there. So anytime you put a coin in, it's going to, all right, shut up, shut up. So like I said, anytime you put a coin in there, it'll trigger this side piece. It'll, it'll push it in as you put the coin in. And I'll be like, ah, yeah, put some money in your piggy bank. You may win a prize. I'm not a parent yet, but I think that'd be a cool thing I'd do with my kids. But uh, altogether, 25 bucks. What would I rate this out of 10? The whole experience with the cost and everything. I would give this a solid 9.5 out of 10. The only drawback is, like I said, the D battery power source. I would much rather be able to uh, plug this in somewhere where I don't have to worry about buying anything else for the machine ever again. But uh, yeah, this is very impressive. I will say if you are at a store and you always had the curiosity, always kind of wanted to have a cool little machine in your house as a claw machine and you see this and you're thinking eh, i don't know that looks kind of crappy no do not sleep on this thing this is absolutely fun and challenging and it's just cool so yeah that's what i'll give this the claw 9.5 out of 10 cool machine definitely pick it up and i am so happy i bought this thing so, anyways, that is it for me. Thank you guys for watching. I am DJ Glowing Ice, and I will see you next time. Peace. <laughs>